What's up, y'all? JSP the Creator, and I'm back again with a new creation to date for y'all. Hell yeah! Hey, come on, baby! Come on! Yes! Come on! Ah! In today's video, we're gonna be customizing something a little bit different. Probably something y'all never heard of. I'm a sneakerhead. I'm a fan of dope stuff. Like, it doesn't necessarily always have to be Nike, Adidas, uh, uh, uh. Name, what's his name? I got nothing on a name. Come on, baby, what's the name? We throw out his name! No! Jordan, etc. If it's fire, I'ma keep my eye on it, alright? And so today I'm gonna introduce y'all to a new brand. Well, it's not really new, but it's probably new to y'all, like I said. Not new to me, new to y'all. So the brand I'm gonna be working on today is known as Sia, somewhere in America. And the CEO of that brand, Devlin Carter, known as FBCC, was a customizer who used to, you know, take apart Jordans, put them back together with like exotic animal uh, prints and stuff like that. And so he decided to, you know, F, you know, making other people's stuff hot. How about I make my own stuff hot? So that's what he did. He came out with his own brand, and right now his sneakers are smoking hot. Sneaker drops that he usually has are ridiculous, creative, all that. You know, the fire glow in the dark, got that. 3M, got that. Color changing, got that. Concepts, got that. All right, packaging, got that. All right, so because of all those things, you know, they sell out like hotcakes, so they're really difficult to come across, you know. They produce quality stuff, man. Comfort, quality is there, craftsmanship is there, and you can't beat those three things when it comes to footwear or clothing, period, because they also got clothing as well. So quality, craftsmanship, and, you know, comfort is there. So that's another reason why I like the brand. I myself have two pairs, but I will be customizing one. There's a little backstory here. I'm gonna show y'all quickly two of my pairs that I have. I have the Culture Vulture V2s, you know, ice cream glows. You know, I think these jumps are, are more fire than the Yeezy sock runs, you know what I mean? Plus the shoe glow in the dark, you know, whole thing. I'll probably show y'all in a little clip or video or whatever, you know, mix up. Um, they're pretty dope though, like I said, I wear my stuff. I, I don't keep them on ice, I wear my stuff. It's hot, I'm gonna put it on my feet. So that's the V2 lows, you know what I'm saying, culture vultures. And the other pair I have is a collaboration that he did with a other artist who photoshops like colorways for different J's, mock-up designs, stuff like that. Um, recently took a Fear of God cover and attached it to a Jordan 6 midsole. And the shoe surgeon created that design that he created. His, name's, his name on Instagram is J's Are Dead. And so J's Are Dead and um, the owner of Saya had a little, you know, collaboration and they came up with this colorway. You know, I caught these two. These are clean, super dope, um, glow in the dark bottoms. Very clean shoe. But backstory is originally I wasn't trying to get this specific model. I was trying to get the low top version of this. But the shoe sold out. So I ended up getting the high tops, which also sold out. But in my attempt of getting the low top, I was conversing with one of my clients, uh, Camden, I did a pair of Jordan 6s for him and those LeBron 8, well, LeBron John Elliott's 8s that I did, the South Beach joints. I did those for, for Camden. So me and Camden got a cool relationship. So we both buy shoes from Saya all the time. So what ended up happening was, like I said, the shoe sold out. So I was in communication with him while, you know, we were both trying to get the shoe. So he ended up getting a low top. So Camden wants me to customize a pair of his low tops. Now, in his attempt to get the low tops, he also tried to give me the high tops, but I myself scored on the high tops. So he ended up with an extra pair of high tops. And, you know, being the cool dude that he is, he sent me the high tops as a gift, you know? And so I'm gonna customize both. I don't know what I'm gonna do to the high tops yet, but the low tops, I got some special plan. And that's this bad boy right here. This is the low top. I got a little something planned for this one you know the extra pair of high tops um shout out to camden like i said cool dude sneakerhead big sneakerhead um you know he's dope he's cool he's a cool person he's a genuine person on it so being the cool dude that he is i'm gonna hit these with uh something orange you know um i went to the university of oregon he went to oregon state we have a little bit of a rivalry but you know i'm gonna look out he's a cool dude but um yeah you know you all all day 
but yeah, I'm gonna hook it up with something orange, something nice, something dope, something creative, something different. Like I said, it's a different brand. We don't always gotta stick to the Nike, the Jordan, the Adidas, the blah, blah, blah. Sometimes we gotta give a little bit of a, 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 a look at something different, something new, something unique. And like I said, Saya has something unique going on. They got a good movement. And I'm mess with the sneakers, man. They got a lot of fire stuff. Check them out. But let's get into this custom. Once again, guys, thanks for checking out today's video on these Saya E2s. Kind of just went with an orange theme, added a little color shift on that midsole to give it some extra pop. And uh, I think they came out came out pretty solid. If you ask me, it's a pretty solid colorway. Camden, I hope you like them, because I do. As I said before, if you're a fan of quality, you're a fan of creativity, I suggest you start looking into the brand, into Saya, um, check out their gear. Um, you know, like I said, it's something different, something unique, and it's quality. So I personally will be having more Saya in my life. So I might be customizing more. I might just have more to rock. But as I said before, if you guys like this video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and don't forget to hit that bell notification. And, you know, enjoy your day, night, or whatever time of whatever it is for you. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. I'm rambling. But... That's about it. I don't know what I'm gonna do to the high tops, but that's what I did to the lows. I like them, they're cool. And I will see you guys till next time, till my next project or my next review or whatever I'm gonna do next. Stay tuned. Peace.